Hey guys, welcome to another Dimash reaction. As you can notice, I'm not currently at home. I'm in my hometown in the Czech Republic. This is not a fake tree. This is the actual tree. No green screen, nothing like that. I just went home to visit my mom and to enjoy a bit of holiday. And I thought I tried something new. I thought I tried reacting with my travel setup from different places and see how it goes. So hope you enjoy this. If you're new to this channel, I've done one reaction to Dimash so far and I'm just discovering him. This is my second song from the many recommendations I have received. I just randomly chosen a song called Stranger because the comment mentioned that it showcases his range and I kind of pointed out that he's a high tenor or counter tenor and all of you were like, oh no, he's not a tenor. He is a low voice and everything. So I just want to check it out. I want to see what he's capable of really. So let's get into it. Demash and Stranger. Спасибо. Спасибо. Спасибо yeah. огромное. А теперь прозвучит Thank you in Russian. Новая песня. Новая песня. New songs. I understand him actually. Czech is not fo uh, Czech language is not so dissimilar to Russian. What attention! Oh my goodness! Did you hear that, by the way? There's a bird. Keep making noises. <sighs> Guys, I apologize. Like when I heard the first song, the SOS, the first version, I kind of thought like, yeah, this is like a tenor, you know, very high tenor, nothing too special, impressive, but you know, there's many, many impressive singers in the world. <sighs> when he started the low voice, like I, I'm, like, I was like, is it even him singing it? Is it like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Pretty, with pretty like pretty pretty deep color as well. He certainly knows how to use his voice. Oh my good! And he started really really soft, which was also pretty cool because 
sometimes, not just in music, but in life in general, we think that we need to be loud to be noticed. We need to raise our voice to get other people to notice us. But sometimes it's actually better to lower your voice to make people want to listen to you. Another thing is that when you start really softly, you have somewhere to grow because you don't use all of your dynamic range or whatever at the start. Really, really impressive how he can work with his voice, starting really, really soft, then the low, full-bodied, I would call it. That's more description of a wind, but you know what I mean. Going all the way to the high belt. Let's keep going. This is amazing. Thank you, guys. What an interesting instrument. Change of key. Again, his focus. Effortless. softness again new ground underneath my feet stranger in a stranger's land <laughs> you chance to know who I am we will have this way to begin Браво! ну конечно, невероятные эмоции мы испытываем от голоса Димаша. Димашку Даберген, браво! Спасибо огромное, спасибо, спасибо. Игорь Крутой! Кто этот человек? Let me know in the comments, who is the guy. Мой друг, гость из Казахстана. Уолжас Хурманбек. Is he the composer or? Yeah. Спасибо! Вау, 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 вау. Ууу, thanks for sharing, вау. This was awesome. I also teach singing, I'm a vocal coach, and basically the number one problem that singers have is that these swallowing muscles prevent us from having relaxed, effortless technique, right? So basically we, we prevent ourselves from having loose, uh, open voice. So most of the lessons are usually just to help people discover where their tensions are and how to relax them so their voice can kind of go naturally out. You can see, no matter where he is in his range, like the singing just sounds so effortless for him. He just opens his mouth and it's like a well-oiled machine. He just lets the sound out effortlessly. Now I know he's incredibly talented, but don't get me wrong, I don't think it's obviously just talent. It's incredible, impressive hard work. <sighs> This is, this is so awesome. I just remembered there was a comment on my video that they should do a sing-off with Adam Lombard because that's another 
impressive performer. And I would find it very hilarious not just to see them perform against each other or even to do a comparison on YouTube. I could do something like that. Let me know in the comments, actually. Would you enjoy if I did a comparison of Dimash and Adam Lambert and maybe analyze their ranges and see how they stand? What would be the most enjoyable for me about it is the clash of their fans in the comments because I've done reactions to both and I noticed both uh, both of you guys, like the fan bases, are really like, and rightfully so, are really in love with them. They're they're amazing and I kind of get it. So I would like to see like the the clash of opinions about who's better, whether Adam Lambert or Dimash. That would be really enjoyable to read. So maybe, yeah, maybe it's a good idea. Let me know. So... I hope you enjoyed this outdoor sort of reaction. Maybe the sounds in the background, the sounds of the singing birds were a little bit of an ASMR for you as well. And I might do a couple more because I'll be staying in the Czech Republic for next uh, next few days. So I might do a few more reactions from different places. Check the descriptions for ways to work with me or supporting my channel. And I can't wait to see you in the next video, whether it's Dimash, Adam Lambert, comparison of the two or different bands. Stick around. See you in the next one. Keep it funky. Whew.